Hey, welcome back to my subs to my channel. And welcome to anybody that may be new to my channel. I'm Brandon Nagley. Today is October 20th, 2020. The time is now 9.35 p.m. Um, Eastern Standard Time. Anybody new to my channel, I show the signs in the heavens that Yeshua, Jesus Christ, also known as Jesus Christos in Greek, or Yeshua in Hebrew, which his Hebrew name means salvation, or also known as Yehoshua. He's known by he's known by many different names, and as I tell people that come to my channel, stop you know stop arguing over stupid stuff like his names, Christians, because you know it's not the name. Well, yeah, his name does mean a lot, but it's Jesus Christ himself, Yeshua, that saves you. Simply, Jesus Christ is the English translation of Yeshua. Okay, but people want to sit here and argue over stupid stuff in these last days. What I show are the signs in the heavens that Jesus Christ, Yeshua, Jesus Christos, call him whatever you want, warned to be seen in the heavens before his coming. Specifically, I show the Planet X system as Planet X is biblical wormwood of, Revela of Revelation 8. As Vatican calls Planet X biblical wormwood, just as they have a telescope named the Lucifer Telescope. It's not by accident that the Jesuits that run the Vatican, which are not Christian at all, all and they're not Catholic, they're Jesuits, and their god is Satan. You know, and, and they talked to Tom Horn, a very big prophecy teacher, sorry about that. If you go look up Tom Horn YouTube videos and actually told him why they have a telescope up on Mount up on Mount Graham, Arizona, on Holy Land, Native Holy Land, that the Jesuits stole. They stole that native land because the native people know that there are portals that can be opened up over that land. It's been known for that for thousands of years. And what the, the Vatican looks for on Mount Graham is the Planet X system. They watch it. That's just one of the many places, not including in Chile, where they watch Planet X. Um, you know, at a certain point. Sorry, I'm trying to get in a good position for you guys here to show you this. But anyways, you know, what the Jesuits admitted is what they watch for the Planet X system, but they also admitted they're waiting for their, quote, serpent saviors. We know those to be demonic beings, what the mainstream media is pushing, aliens. Why do you think they're pushing that? Because after the rapture of the church, after the rapture of Christians, aliens, quote-unquote, will be the big excuse why Christians have disappeared while the, you know, why they were raptured or caught up or repeat more in Latin. Anyways, I want to show you guys this really quick. I show the signs in the heavens as I stated that Yeshua Jesus Christ spoke about before his coming, specifically the Planet X system as Planet X of uh, Revelation 8 is Biblical Wormwood. That's what Biblical Wormwood is, you know. Um, Planet X will not hit the earth as a lot of these false videos like to put out, and a lot of these uh, mainstream media try to make, make us researchers look stupid and look nuts. Look at this. I hate this crap that always pops up. Watch live Black uh, Lives Matter protests. I always get these updates because I'm subscribed to so many people, you know. Um, anyway, anyways, what I'm showing you here right now is Stereo Head H1, uh, HI1. But before I, before I show you this, also, the red dragon of Revelation 12 is a representative of Satan, but also Planet X as well. The red dragon shall cast its stars from its tail. The ancients knew stars be meteorites, also asteroids or fireballs. Also, stars are known as planets to the ancient people. Um, the red dragon will cast its stars. Planet X has a debris tail that's longer than Jupiter. That stretches longer than Jupiter as Earth has entered into a debris field right now. An asteroid debris field that the governments worldwide are watching. As the debris is already coming in, I show that down my channel. If you look down my videos, I'm the number one person on YouTube that shows the asteroid debris coming in. Not just from this debris field we're entering into, but also Planet X system debris is also headed towards Earth. And especially after the rapture of the church, that those fireballs, which I've had in... At least six to seven fireball dreams from Christ. If you look up on YouTube, look up fireball dreams and visions. Joel 2 and Acts chapter 2 says, God will pour out his spirit in the last days upon all flesh that your sons and your daughters shall prophesy. Your old men shall dream dreams and your young men shall see visions in the last days. And that God will pour out his spirit upon his handmaids and the hand serpents in the last days. That's what's happening worldwide. Go on YouTube, look up Antichrist dreams, fireball dreams, and visions, by the way. Antichrist dreams and visions, rapture dreams and visions, Planet X, Wormwood dreams and visions, Nibiru dreams and visions. Okay, look those up. 
Millions around the world are having these dreams and visions and prophesying what's to come as I've had multiple fireball dreams seeing they will hit globally by the millions and killing millions. So to get back into this, what you're looking at is Stereo Head H... Um, yeah, H H I one I believe. I think that's how you pronounce it, but... Okay, over here, guys. Over here is the sun to the left. You cannot see the sun. But what you can see is the sun shooting off flares to the right. Where this line is right here. This line is connecting to one of our planets of our solar system right there. And here's, a, I believe, another planet of our solar system right there. A little small dot right next to the big white thing right there. Look behind it, guys. Okay? There's a massive spherical object. I'm putting my finger on it. Going all the way around right here. It's a massive body. Watch this as I play it. This object has been seen many times. Um, I believe it is. Look at that. It just lit up. It's a big, large Planet X system body. Now, is it that close to the sun? Um, researchers do not believe so. I don't believe so. Obviously, because the sun would act up more. But, it, you know, it, it seems more like it's, it's, it's definitely showing itself. Even though it's farther away, it's close up enough to be seen. As you see the flares coming from the sun from the left side going towards the right. And you can see, I believe that's Venus. Forgive me if I'm wrong, but that's Venus. And you can see this big, massive, heavenly body that's a lot bigger than the sun. As you guys can see the evidence clearly right there. In the rest of my video, guys, what I'm going to show you, um, you're going to see pictures of a meteor. More meteor debris has come in over Arizona, Phoenix. You're going to see... Uh, maybe some more footage by me, and I don't know if I'm going to put footage by me or by Mr. MBB333 YouTube channel that showed footage of a Planet X system meteor um, also passing. But what you guys got to simply know is, you know, time short, guys. You know, the governments worldwide are planning for the chaos coming, especially around election time. And they're planning for complete civil war and chaos, whether it's around election time or afterwards. They're planning for the planet x system debris coming in you simply gotta know john 3 16 you know john 3 16 states for god so loved the world he gave us his only begotten son jesus christ yeshua that whoever believes in him believes in jesus christ should not perish but have everlasting life john 14 6 jesus said i am the way the truth and the life and no man comes to the father god but by me romans 10 13 states whoever shall call upon the name of the lord shall be saved Excuse me, you got to know Jesus Christ died for all mankind's sins. It don't matter what color, what religion you are, what background you're from. The Bible says, for all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. We're all sinners, guys. Based on what Adam and Eve did in the beginning of time, they sinned against God. They disobeyed God and picked that fruit off the tree. And what happened is that sin passed down to all mankind, to everybody, to Jew and Gentile. And Gentile means anybody not Jewish. Is it the Bible states... God's holy people are the Jewish people. I'm not talking about the Rockefellers and Rothschilds, the elite that run this world, which the Bible calls the synagogue of Satan, fake Jews that proclaim to be Jews and are not. I'm not talking about them. I'm talking about the real 12, 12 tribes our Bible talks about that's going to be protected during the judgment hour of 144,000 and 12,000 in each tribe of those different types of tribes. And Jews, the Jewish people are you know, included in that. They're protected by God, but there's also false Jews, as I stated. But, you know, there's Jew and Gentile, and all have sin. That, that sin passed down to all of us, guys. But God sent His only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, who, who is also God in the flesh, who came to this planet Earth, took on flesh as a human being, but without sin. He was spotless, the spotless Lamb of God, as the Bible states. <clears throat> Excuse me, I might not even be able to post any pictures after this, but I might make another video tomorrow showing the Arizona meteor and stuff, guys. But read below the video, see how to accept Christ as your Lord and Savior. Um, it's sin passed down to all mankind. We're all sin sinners, guys. You know, everybody's lied. Everybody's 
done some type of sin. So you can't say, you know, the Bible says, whoever says that they have not sinned makes God a liar. Because we are all sinners. We were all born into sin. And we have all sinned, whether it's thievery, whether it's lying, whether it's fornication, you know, which is like masturbation and stuff like that. Idolatry, worshiping other gods. That could mean even worshiping money, worshiping food. You love something more than God. That's idolatry or adultery, you know, lusting after, the Bible says lusting after a woman, even a man is the same as, as sinning, you know, because you're lusting after the flesh. But God wants us to be holy and turn from sin right now, guys. No matter who you are, Jesus Christ came to this earth to die for you because he loves you that much. God loves you so much. John 3, 16, for God so loved the world, he gave us his only begotten son, Jesus, that whoever believes in him and Jesus Christ should not perish but have everlasting life. He took our, our sin and shame and guilt on his body on the cross. He was crucified, buried, and rose the third day that whoever calls on Jesus Christ, Yeshua's name, shall be saved. Time's about up, guys. Time is about up. It's time to love another. It's time to forgive another and put aside hate as God is love and he's light and he's mercy and he's forgiveness. And it's sad because every, every day I post videos, I have government trolls to come to my channel and people that just don't like christ they want nothing to do with god so they hit that dislike button i don't give a crap about likes and dislikes i'm here to tell you truth i'm not here to make you feel good like most of these planet x system channels all they care about is money i don't ask for money all they care about is likes and views and being right i can name a few people right now i'm not going to do that and they even claim to be christians but yet most of you guys sit there and watch them that's on you guys. I'm here to tell you the truth. That Jesus Christ is coming again to rapture up his church. The word rapture is not in the Bible. No, but it was in the... Um, just like the word Bible is not in the Bible. But the word rapture comes from St. Jerome that translated Paul's words. Caught up or rapia mor in Latin or harpazo in the Greek. It means the actual physical removal of the, ch of the church from one place to another in ecstasy. And Bible verses of, of the rapture can be found in 1 Thessalonians 4, 1 Corinthians 15, John 14, 3. The Bible says God has not appointed us to wrath, but to obtain salvation in Jesus Christ. Revelation 3.10, the most well-known pre-tribulation rapture verse. Revelation 12.5, the child of Revelation 12.5 is the church that gets caught up, repeat more, raptured in English, the actual physical removal of the church from one place to another, caught up to God's throne before the dragon can reach the child in Revelation 12.5. Your, your time's short, guys. Planet X system debris is coming in. They're setting up for chaos around or after the election sometime. More big quakes are coming because of the Planet X system heating up Earth's core. And the atmosphere is heating up with particles charged, ready to explode like a bomb. That's what's causing also more quakes from the Planet X system radiation debris coming in. More radiation. Love and forgive another. If you have hate in your heart towards somebody, forgive them. Read under my video and see how to accept Christ as Lord. Because your guys' time is short and it's about up. Love and forgive another, guys, and accept Christ as Lord. God bless.